please subscribe to Face TV Africa and turn the notification on. Face TV Africa, and your subscribe, subscribe, and hit it. Face TV. Muswobi. Lagos State Council of the National Association of Nigerian Nurses and Midwives has said that the suspect reportedly arrested for injecting the late musician Ilirilua Aluba, aka Mubad, is not a registered nurse. This was contained in the statement signed by Lagos State Secretary of NANNM, Toba Odumosu. The association also warned members of the media to confirm the qualifications of professional status of individuals before brandishing them as healthcare professionals. It will be recalled that 27-year-old singer Mubad died on September the 12th. Mubad father Joseph Aluba on September 14th claimed that the singer passed away after receiving an injection administered by an auxiliary nurse. He said, according to what I heard from people, I do not believe in that. The only thing I can think of is maybe this auxiliary nurse that I used to treat people, which is a very bad idea. I do not know the kind of level the woman is. They said they called her to give him an injection. And that is a very bad idea and that injection can result in any length he had wounds but i do not know the kind of wounds he had the police on thursday exhumed mumbad's corpse for autopsy vowing investigations into his death will be thorough while sharing his condolences to the family of the deceased the Lagos state council of midwives and nurses emphasized the importance of professionalism in reporting and conducting the ongoing investigation into the controversial circumstances surrounding mumbad's death the National Association of Nigerian Nurses and Midwives Lagos State Council expresses its deepest condolences to the family and associates of the late musician Ilerirua Aluba, popularly known as Mobad. During this difficult time, our thoughts and prayers are with them as we mourn his tragic passing. We fully support the ongoing investigation into the circumstances surrounding his death and urge the relevant authorities to leave no stone unturned in the pursuit of justice for him. However, we must stress the importance of professionalism in reporting and conducting this investigation. NANNM is closely monitoring the situation with keen interest. Our preliminary investigations indicate that the individual reportedly taken into custody by the police for providing care to Mubad is not a registered nurse. We emphasize the critical need to verify the qualifications and professional status of individuals before labeling them as healthcare professionals. The council said it was Regrettable that Nigeria's healthcare system faces significant regulatory challenges leading to the presence of unqualified individuals performing medical roles as they are not trained for. In Nigeria, to be recognized as a nurse, one must complete a rigorous five-year Bachelor of Nursing Science program at a university, followed by an additional year of internship. Alternatively, one can undergo training at an accredited school college of nursing and become registered and licensed by the Nursing and Midwifery Council of Nigeria. We wish to clarify that the term auxiliary nurse has no place within Nigeria's healthcare system or its laws. An individual is either a qualified nurse or an unqualified individual performing tasks beyond their competence. Furthermore, we call on the investigating authorities and the media to exercise caution and accuracy in their reporting during this investigation. We will not tolerate any misrepresentation of nurses and the nursing profession. We demand that all media outlets that inaccurately reported the arrest of a nurse take immediate corrective action to rectify their stories, the body added. Please subscribe to Face TV Africa and turn the notification on. Face TV Africa, enjoy and subscribe. Subscribe and hit it. Face TV. Muswobi.